Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we are going to discuss relationships in table in OpenOffice database. Let's see here, in a database, relationships are defined link that associate two tables through a common field, which means we can say that two tables in relation, if they have a common field to create a relationship between both tables. Let's see here. Relationship example here and uh, we have a two table student and a grade The rule number name and class is the fields of the student table and uh, The grade table have a rule number and a grade. They have the uh, two fields and Student table has a three fields, but look here the rule number and the rule number Exist in both table. So we can say that the rule number is a common field in the student and grade table. So we can say that the student table and grade table are in the relationship. Now, types of relationship. There are three types of relationship. One to one, one to many and many to many. We will discuss in details one by one. First of all, I'm going to discuss about the one to one relationship. In one to one relationship, each record in a table E can have only one matching record in table B and each record in table B can have only one matching record in table A. Which means if suppose that we have a two table A and B, so table A have one record and which is matching with the only one record of the table B and table B has a one record matching with the table A only one. So, I'm just going to explain with a simple example here. Look here. We have uh, two tables, student and uh, grade. And uh, so we can see that uh, student table has uh, three records. Row number one, Rakesh and class 10. Row number two, Ramesh and class 10. Row number three, Amit and class 10. Look here, and the grade is 1, A grade, rule number 1 has a 1 A grade, and rule number 2 has a B grade, and rule number 3 has a C grade. Look here, the rule number 1, suppose that we have a table A, suppose that we have a table A, one matching record with the table B, which is great, and the table B has one matching record with the table A, so we can say that the both table, means student table and the grade table, have is in one to one relationship now just move to the second one to many relationship in one to many relationship a record in table a can have many matching record in table b but a record in table b can have only one matching record in table a which means we have a two tables a table and b tables a table has multiple or uh, many matching records with the table B, but the B table has only one uh, only one matching record with the table A. Let's see here. I have an example. Suppose that we have a two tables, teacher and the student, and the teacher ID is 101, Rakesh, teacher ID 102, and Ramesh, 103 as a myth. And suppose that 102, Ramesh, teach the class student, which is Rule number 1, 2, 3, and their name is Ram, Sam, and Hamid. So, one teacher teach multiple students. So, we can say that here exists the one to many relationship. Okay, and rule number 1 has a one matching with the Ramesh. Rule number 2 has a one matching, Ramesh, teacher ID 102, and rule number 3, one matching Ramesh and teacher ID 102. So we can say that the both table teacher and a student have a one to many relationships. Now move to the many to many relationship. In many to many relationship, a record in a table A can have many matching record in table B and a record in table B can have many matching record in table A. So we can say that, suppose that we have a two tables A and B so the table a has many matching record with the table b and table b has many matching record with the table a 
so we can say that many to many relationship for example a teacher teach the multiple subject and multiple subject teach by the multiple teacher so we can say that the teacher table and the subject table are in many to many relationship okay now move for the practical here just minimize it and now i'm open the open office okay click on the database and create a new database click on the finish here you need to create a database so i'm just giving here my database to name as a new database 20 and then save it okay look here i'm go i need to create uh, two tables which create the relationship now just click on the table tab and create table in design view and now i'm going to write the field here as a roll number and your data type as an integer and name and class okay make the roll number as a primary key and save this table as a student okay click on ok close it create another table as a roll number field and integer and then name marks okay and make the rule number as a primary key okay and save it with the marks okay and then close it now i'm just going to create a relationship between the student and marks table so first of all i'm just going to enter some data into the student table as a rule number one and name as a ram and class as a 10 save it okay and open the marks table and also take a rule number as a one and name as a ram and mark as a hundred and save it now i'm going to create the relationship between the two tables so click on the tool and uh, tools and then click on the relationship add and then add the marks table okay and then close it okay i need to create the relationship so i'm just select the common field is the rule number so just select the common field and drag and drop it into the marks table and it will create two one to one relationship now just select this and double click here and look here it will show the relationship and now just click on the update cascading and click on ok so here i have created the one-to-one -one relationship between the student and marks table now save it and uh, close it now i'm just going to open the student table and change here as a roll number three and uh, save it okay close it and open the marks table look here it's automatically change the roll number which is previous as a three if you make any changes into the student table in the roll number it will automatically get updated into the marks table in this way we have created the in this way, we have created the one-to-one -one relationship in OpenOffice base. I think you well understand. Thank you, friends. Please like and comment my video. Thanks for watching my video. Thanks a lot.